할렉시스는할렉시스는아주고유명한입니다 Welcome to this performance of Peter and the Wolf, presented as part of the 2019 Awesome International Arts Festival for Bright Young Things. Please switch off your mobile phone. Taking photos or videos during the performance is not permitted. Shortly after this morning show, West o c e a n Valley teaching artists will be running a free activity for anyone who would like to take part. We hope you enjoy this performance of Peter and the Wolf.
This is the story of Peter and the wolf. Each character in this tale will be represented by a different instrument of the orchestra. For example, the bird will be played by the flute, like this. Played by the oboe. <laughs> the cat by the clarinet. The bassoon will represent grandmother. French horns. And Peter by the strings. The blast of a hunter's shotguns is played by the timpani. Sitting comfortably, then I shall begin. Early one morning, Peter opened the gate and went out into the big green meadow. Of a big tree sat a little bird 
Peter's friend. All is quiet, all is quiet, chirped the bird merrily. hadn't closed the gate and decided to take a nice swim in the deep pond in the meadow. Thank you. 
until the duck quacked angrily at the cat. From the middle of the pond. Crawled around the tree and thought, Is it worth climbing up so high? By the time I get there, the bird will have flown away. Just then, Grandmother came out. She was angry because Peter had gone into the meadow. It's a very dangerous place. If a wolf should come out of the forest, then what would you do? Grandmother knew what she was talking about. When she was young, a wolf had tried to trick her. She had its head mounted on her garden wall as a warning to other wolves. <laughs> to grandmother's words. Boys like Peter aren't afraid of wolves. Sight. 
equipment jumped right out of the pond. But ducks are not designed for running and she couldn't get away from the wolf. He was getting nearer, nearer, catching up with her. and with one gulp, swallowed her. was sitting on one branch. The bird on another. Not too close to the cat. doesn't catch you. touched the wolf's head with her wings while the wolf snapped angrily at her from this side and that. little 
could tease the wolf. How that wolf wanted to catch her. But the bird was far too clever, and the wolf simply couldn't do anything about it. and carefully letting it down. And down. And down. Caught the wolf and pulled with all his might. Caught, the wolf began to jump wildly, trying to get loose. the other end of the rope to the tree. <laughs> and the wolf's jumping only made the rope pull tighter. Just then, the hunters came out of the forest. Following the wolf's trail and shooting as they went. said, don't shoot. Bernie and I have already caught the wolf. Now help us take him to the zoo. triumphant procession.
after him, the hunters leading the wolf. shook her head discontentedly. Well, and if Peter hadn't caught the wolf, what then? hear the duck quacking inside the wolf because the wolf in its hurry had swallowed her alive
ready to do some really fun dancing? Who wore a blue tutu? Yeah? The bird! Shall we all practice our bird wings? Can we all practice? Another one. Two arms. Right, I'm a step. You can see them. Very good. Birds also like to fly. Can we fly over this way? And fly back the other way? Good idea. Oh, I see some very beautiful birds. Should we try that with some music? Yeah. Let's go. Okay, let's try with music. Mm -hmm. 